Hey everyone, Joe here again on behalf of the entire team at Theorycraft Games. And today I'm super excited to give you an update on the status of Project Loki, as well as share some news with our players in Asia. It's been about nine months since we introduced Loki to the world and invited you all to play test, give feedback, and help us build something fresh, a new game worthy of thousands of hours of your time. Your response blew us away. Over 150,000 of you have signed up to play Loki in pre-alpha. That's allowed us to scale up our playtesting bigger and faster than we ever could have hoped. If you've been playtesting or following along on Discord, it might not surprise you to hear this. But if you've been waiting for us to commit a bit more, I'm happy to announce that Project Loki is officially in alpha. Being in alpha means different things to different studios. But for us, beyond finally dropping all of the pre-pre-pre-alpha labels, it means that we're committing to the shape of this game and getting ready to ship. Instead of new prototyping, we'll be spending more of our time getting combat systems and art production ready. And you can expect us to be focusing more on stability and performance to ensure we run smoothly on a wide range of systems. It doesn't mean the game won't change at all. With our crew, we'll always be iterating and evolving things. Just that we'll be more selective about big disruptive changes and bias increasingly toward things we need to do in order to ship. This is an exciting milestone for all of us at Theorycraft to share. And as always, I'm so grateful to all of you in our community whose passion and feedback have gotten us this far. This brings me to my second piece of news. Today, I'm thrilled to announce not one, but two incredible partnerships we've made to bring Project Loki to players around the world. As many of you know, a lot of us on the team here at Theorycraft worked on League of Legends, where we developed a deep respect and appreciation for the insanely passionate community of gamers in Asia. And so, from the very beginning, it's always been incredibly important to us to bring Loki to players in that part of the world. That said, as a small team, serving a global audience is a huge task. So we couldn't be more excited to be partnering with NetEase Games to bring Project Loki to players in China, and Nexon to bring Loki to players in Korea and Japan. Both NetEase and Nexon have served some of the most dedicated communities in games for decades. And we're thrilled to have their support in bringing Loki to all the passionate players in these regions. I'm so grateful to NetEase and Nexon for betting on us. Partnerships like these are rare especially in current times, and for new studios with new IPs. To our current and future players in China, Korea, and Japan, we can't wait to play Loki with you. And you can expect to hear more from our partners later this year, including how to pre-register. I suspect this won't be the last time you hear from me this year, so stay posted. In the meantime, for those of you who've been on the journey with us these last few years, I can't thank you enough for sticking with us through all the change and iteration and for helping us discover together what Loki has become. For everyone else, come join us. We'll see you in the playtest. You jinxed it. You jinxed it. Here it comes. Mm.